Dirty it's day 42 of the university sign. occupation, and things are not looking swine. good for Don't Donald Trump, current CEO you of Border Enterprises. What started Don't as an argument over tuition fees has exploded you into a controversial swine. tale Don't of three greedy corporations sign. and one big you bad protest. Three companies, Dryer and Reed, Twigonomics Incorporated, and Mortar Enterprises. They fund research laboratories and develop pharmaceuticals thus making sure that cash goes nowhere else on campus. They use students as slave labour and tuition fees as capital. If the world was watching, Don Scrofer would resign. If the world was just... Don Scrofer should commit ritual suicide! It's bullshit, man! The corporations are f***ing up our education! They're f***ing up our right to, you know, learn sh We can bleep that, right? And how exactly does this movement intend to remedy the situation? Solidarity. We will make the corporations pay with our solidarity. Well, I think it's kind of stupid. You know, camping on the lawn is not a strike. It's definitely not a boycott. And unless economic pressure is applied, the fee hikes will just go through. The fee hikes will not go through. This encampment will not be moved. We will fight against the destruction of public education until we this just in, game-changing news about Don Scroffa, leaked footage of a meeting between Scroffa, Twigonomics chairman Wilbur Webb, and Nathaniel Reed of Dry and Reed seems to indicate that Don Scroffa may have been a mere scapegoat. Then I guess that's our only option. Then it's settled. Mortar Enterprises, which had almost nothing to do with the university, will take the fall and be dissolved. You can't do this. Wow. Well... My opinion hasn't really changed. Somebody has to resign. If not Don Scrofer, then Webb and Reed should step down. Scapegoating? That's kind of a dick move. Boycott Webb and Reed! Boycott Webb and Reed! They're the ones who should commit ritual suicide! Boycott Webb and Reed! Boycott Webb and Reed! Boycott Webb and Reed! Boycott Webb and Reed! Congratulations are in order. You're now the head of a triune empire. You leaked the footage? As per your instructions. And the protesters? Galvanized to order. The boycott will create a vacuum in the drug market for mortar and our subsidiaries to fill. Any complaints from Webb and Reed will be dismissed as further scapegoating. Well done, Wolf. Do you think they'll be forced to resign? Undoubtedly. And what's to stop them from pulling what they've got left and coming after you. Well, what's stopping them is the rest of those tapes. The parts I sincerely hope you didn't leak. As it stands, the carcinogens are almost impossible to trace back to our product because it's meant to be taken with a cocktail of other pharmaceuticals. But what if these protests, all this press, is drawing attention to the labs, and if those studies get out, our influence over the FDA won't matter? What we need, gentlemen, is a scapegoat, a sacrifice to take all our blame and be burned at the altar. Surely you don't mean one of us. One of our companies, whichever one is least associated with the university labs. That's you, Don. Well, I suppose I'll buy back your stock and mortar and let the company die. Naturally, I'll take a little flack, but a dignified resignation is nothing I can't bounce back from. The way I see it, it's the only way to kill this story and ensure that none of us goes to prison. Maybe we should just give the protesters what they want. <laughs> Don't be preposterous. Well then, I guess it's our only option. Well, it's settled then. Mortar Enterprises, which had almost nothing to do with the university, will take the fall and be dissolved. You can't do this half-assed. We either take the plunge, or back off from the ledge. So, when do I get my company car? Here's the thing, Wolf. Aside from Webb, Reed, and myself, you're the only individual that knows our product's side effects, but you don't have the culpability to keep you dishonest. 
What are you saying, Doc? <laughs> You can't half pull a trigger. 